good morning from Italy. I am so, 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 so happy to be here. I actually cannot believe that I just woke up in Italy. Um, we got in last night and I forced myself to get up for sunrise because that's my trick to beating the jet lag on the first day whenever I travel to Europe. I just like need to show you guys this view. I literally am like screaming, crying, throwing up, like I'm gonna die. I can't believe it. I love it here so much. Like when I'm in Italy, my soul just feels happy. I don't know how else to explain it. Like it's just the fucking best. I had two coffees. We just had a stunning breakfast. It is so beautiful. I can't even handle it. And now we're gonna go get a quick workout in and then I think just like spend the day at the beach, pool, hotel. Oh, I'm just so happy. It's so beautiful. found out that Hazel must have peed in my suitcase after I packed it, like the night before I left, because all my bikinis were in one small corner of my suitcase and 90% of my bikinis smell like cat piss. And if you've ever smelled cat piss, it's like really not pleasant. Anyway, so that was fun. I just had to go through and smell all my bikinis and take out the ones that smelled like cat pee. And then I put them in the sink and wash them with some soap. And now they're in the bathtub and hopefully they'll all dry. I just got dressed in one of my bikinis that doesn't smell like cat pee. I bought this bikini for Italy the last time and I literally saved it for like months because I just was like, this bikini belongs in Italy. And then um, the day that I ended up wearing it, it rained. Um, so I feel like I didn't like, I didn't really like get the Italy experience. So put it on again, we're re-wearing it. I have this oversized men's button up from Amazon, little hat. This. Monday swim bag that I'm obsessed with. It's like giant. It's literally the size of me. I have so much shit in here, but I just feel like it's really chic. I'm gonna make my way down to the pool and I think we're just gonna like chill at the hotel today and spend some time at the pool and the beach. There's no plan and I love that. I love being on Italian time. Oh my God, it just keeps getting more beautiful. Not okay. Hi, hello. I made it to dinner time. I'm about to head out to the door to about to head out the door to dinner. Um, for a second, I didn't think I was gonna make it because it started to rain a little bit this afternoon. So we all just kind of like went back to our rooms because it was getting chilly. And then I was sitting in my bed, getting really, really tired. And I was like, I, there's no way I can stay awake. But I did. Um, just freshened up a little bit for dinner. Put on a new outfit. And after dinner, I can go to bed, which means I will have successfully beat the jet lag on day one. I'm very proud. Also, this lighting is really blue and it's making me look like a blueberry. Um, but here's my fit. It's all Abercrombie, actually. Trousers, knit top, um, and then I'm just gonna bring my leather jacket in case it's chilly, but the weather has actually just been amazing. So, very happy about that. Minimal rain. Gonna go eat some pasta and then get gelato and call it a night. Really good. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. That's so good. Yeah, you have to try it. 
Good morning slash afternoon. We just had breakfast, we did a quick workout, and now we are heading to a beach club for the day. Um, so I'm gonna give you a little OTD. Bikini is by Silk Swim. Cover up is from Revolve. I think it's Camilo Coelho collection. It's another stunning day in paradise though. for dinner I am watching the sunset from my balcony and it's insane um, I'm going to show you guys my outfit really quickly so more of my green Sunday label trousers these are like one of my favorite trousers I own and then this little top I think it's from Revolve um, I'll link it below we are going to walk into town and grab dinner somewhere I think I did like some research and I I didn't look that hard. I looked while we were at the pool yesterday, but I found a restaurant that looks really good. So we're going to go there. And yeah, we had the best day today. We literally took um, a boat over from Amalfi, which is where we're staying. Kind of like right next to Positano to this beach club. I forget what it was called. I'll like put everything in the description or in the video. But it was a little beach club with like the iconic umbrellas. And we just like had lunch, drank a bunch of spritzes, went in the ocean, and it was amazing. I just fucking love Italy so much, like, so much. And it's like such a good group of people. Before I went on this trip, I actually only knew my friend Amanda and Jared. And then I briefly met Carrie and Holly, another couple, like for 30 minutes one day. And I didn't know anyone else going. And it's just like such a good group of people and it's just been so much fun and I'm just so, happy to be here i feel like i keep saying that but i am and i feel like i've been shit at vlogging i haven't really like talked to you guys much i've just been like showing you how beautiful everything is so hopefully you don't mind had breakfast did a quick workout in the gym also like i don't know about you guys but a i love working out on vacation and b when i do work out on vacation it just like makes me feel like three million times more productive than when i work out not on vacation i don't know why it just feels like such a big accomplishment so did a workout i actually just did like a 12 3 30 on the treadmill situation because yesterday we did a workout video excuse me i have to sneeze <laughs> Yesterday we followed our friend Sammy Clark's workout video. Um, she's a fitness instructor. You guys probably know who she is. She was supposed to come on this trip and she couldn't because of a passport issue. It was expired and she didn't know. So we did her workout um, to pretend she was here with us. And I'm so sore from it because I feel like it's just like different moves than I normally do for Pilates. And now we're gonna go jump in the ocean for a morning dip and I'm so freaking excited. And I'm wearing my favorite swimsuit ever. It's this one piece from um, Frankie's and it's literally the most flattering one piece in the world. I don't think they make it anymore, but I'm freaking obsessed with it. Whoa.
to take a cute pizza photo. That one's good. Yeah. Slightly cheat at the camera. Yeah. 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 Yes. And then giggle. <laughs> I have no faith. No, they're really cute. No. No. I oh, see, I think they're so cute. I see. This is why I can't eat food. Not it for me. Quench it. Let it let it fall on that side. Yeah. 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 Um, but we were headed out on a boat day today, so I haven't even left my room yet. I, of course, did not leave myself time to work out or get breakfast because I just was tired. I've been, like, staying up really late trying to, like, upload content and work and stuff because when we get home, we're, like, getting in bed. It's literally the middle of the day in L.A., um, and then I always have trouble waking up in the morning. It's, like, really catching up to me how tired I am. But it's fine. We're going on a boat today. I'm about to go meet the squad in the lobby. I'm gonna show you guys my outfit really quick. And I have like literally three outfit changes with me today because we're like going on a boat, we're going to town, we're going to lunch, like we're doing all these things. So I figured I would take advantage. I have this bikini from 437. And then my pants are from Risa. They're really good, like silky trousers. And then my hat is from Monday Swim. And that's the first outfit. fit check for you guys because I'm late or I'm not late but I'm about to be late and we gotta go we have a ferry coming to pick us up and then we're going to another beach club for the day I had breakfast I worked out going strong it's the second to last day I'm literally so sad I am wearing this little yellow set from Aero Swim it's so cute and then I have this bikini on from Same Swim that I'm obsessed with I actually borrowed it from one of the girls they had like two of them and I was so obsessed with it and like Look at how cute the bottoms are. They were like, I have another one you can wear it. So I'm so excited. Going to another beach club. Yeah. 
I just woke up. I have to sneeze. <coughs> it's so bright. <laughs> I literally just woke up because I was like laying in bed and I was like, no, you're not going to lay here. It's the last day you are going to get up and soak up every freaking second of it. So my throat is like kind of dry. I feel like it's from jumping in the ocean. It's like so salty. And like if I get any in my nose or my ears, it like really fucks up my throat. This trip has been like an absolute freaking dream. Like I literally just keep looking at myself, not looking at myself, like thinking to myself, like how is this real life? How is this my life? What did I do to deserve this? Like just so fucking grateful and so happy. And like my heart is full, my soul is happy. I just, chef's kiss. I have on this silk swim bikini. And this dress, I don't remember where this dress is from. I feel like Zara to be honest. But it's the best. Face down, keep it face down. Shut up. Like, how do you know for who? They're crafted specifically for a person. Keep it face down. <laughs> oh my god, lucky! Yeah, you're, you're right. Lucky. No. <laughs> That's good. No. Alright. No. Oh. Oh. This group is really impressive. <laughs> mm -hmm. And then, because nobody drank more Aperol. Oh. <laughs> oh. Aperol Linguini. Aperol Linguini. So cute. No, no.